people welcome to Sunday the 10th of February welcome to the mess I've just done a quick review on the Neverfull because it was requested I do one and people <laughs> people now, I've also done a quick shorts video on this Dior lipstick everything out the Neverfull and then of course you bring out other bags and other bags and other bags and other bags and <laughs> That's the first time I've ever cinched my bag in as well. Look, it's actually not bad. Cinched it in. Actually what I did was, I brought these two and tied them in the middle. Where is it? Where's the other one? This. And I tied that in the middle and it made it look, here we go, in there. It made it look like the bucket bag. I was quite impressed with myself when I did that. There we go. That's that. Now let's uh, tidy the whole bag up. So basically, do you not look, see, that's what I was saying in the video. You just tie it there, like so. Doesn't it look like the bucket bag now? It does, doesn't it? So let's unclip it all and uncinch it all. It's getting warm under this light, my people. There we go. It's funny how you forget to do these reviews. I haven't done kind of like bag reviews. I even forget the name of the bags and all of that. I think. Right, I'll finish packing all this, tidying it up, and then I'm probably going to go for my dinner. We are having mixed fish. Rico's going to fry it today. It's going to make it as healthy as possible because sometimes you just need a bit of fried food, but he is frying in olive oil. So, yeah, <laughs> so many things, honestly, ridiculous. Rico is busy Excuse frying. Me. We have calamari here. What are you frying in there? Monkfish. Monkfish. What have you got in there? Is that the monkfish? That's haddock. And the haddock. Mm. What have you got in there? Chips. Chips upstairs finishing a bit of editing look at my wee baby right by my side always that's what my Lulu used to do as well always by my side I don't want to say her name because I don't want to disturb her but she knows don't you you know what I'm talking about your baby girl yes you do my bubba I love you I do love you lots do you love me as well here we go. This is our Saturday night dinner. Absolutely delicious. With some chips. Mayo and tomato sauce, Rico. Spiaccio. What did you put in it? Spiaccio. What's that? Oh, that hot stuff? Yeah. It's not hot. It's okay with the mayo. And a nice salad. Good morning. Welcome to the Shrove Tuesday, which means it's the 13th. Of, oh, there's Amazon one, but that's for me. It's the 13th of February. I am just going to get Lily ready. Is she coming to me? Should we start that again? It was Amazon and it was for me. So I have ordered, <laughs> I have ordered the castor oil from Amazon. Let me show you actually. Let me get Lily ready. Let me show you. Let me show you. I'm sitting in the middle of the hall. Poor Lily. So you know I was having this discussion about castor oil and whether I should get it or not. That's my coat there ready. I need to go for a walk. So this is the one I got. So I went for organic one and it's a hundred percent pure and cold pressed. That's the one that I went for. And I'll link it in my description box. And my battery is flashing. Okay. So it's got with it. Oh, all it's got is the pump. Right, I need to check that. I need to check that because when I ordered it, it was supposed to have the wee thing for your eyelashes and all of that. Anyway, let me get Lily ready now. Wish she's disappeared. Lily, come on! <laughs> I'll have the press again. Okay, I just checked my order. So that's that one doesn't have the wee mascara things like for your eyelashes so I must have been looking at a different one doesn't matter 
I do it with my fingers. <laughs> so I've looked for all the um, things that uh, it's only wallpaper was saying. So it's natural, it's organic certified, it's 100% pure, it's cold pressed and it's hexane free. Okay, it's vegan and all of all of that. And it was, I think it was about £12. So, that's the one I got. I think it's a French, French brand. And we'll see how it goes. One more thing to add to the night routine. That and the teeth whitening. That's how my teeth go towards the light. That's my teeth. I think it, actually, if I had to be honest, I think it has made a bit of a difference uh, to my teeth. Right, let me go and grab Lily, change my battery, and get out for a walk, because I still have to clean all of downstairs. I started before I went to the gym. I, um... I cleaned my windows, cleaned the majority of the windows upstairs before I went to the gym. So I went to the gym and I did Queen Axe half an hour and then I did my own workout. Back in the position we <laughs> started. There we go. Let's get your little coat on. Make sure we get both pores in. Hey, my baby girl. Oh, the sun is out today, so that's why I've got my sunglasses on my head. So we've got all types of weather today. Get your bum up, bum up. Right. That's my good girl. And then the other, the other one in. Lily is such a good natured dog. She has got a much nicer nature than Lula did, but Lula was my girl. But you're my girl now, aren't you? You're my girl. Let's get you all buttoned up. It's a clever girl. One. Two. Three. Four. There we go. That's my clever girl. There we go. Come here. We hand this on. Hold that up. Get you all nice and cosy. And that's you. There we go. She's my baby girl. She's my baby girl. Yeah, you my baby girl. Yes, you are. So we've managed to get out. Let me tell you, it is freezing. It may be sunny. It's freezing, isn't it, my Lily? Beautiful girl. Oh, I'm so glad I wrapped up well. You know, it's quite deceiving when you're in the house and the sun is beaming through. But it's not until you get outside you realise actually how cold it is. But it's nice. It's crisp, isn't it, Lily? I ask her as if she's going to answer. Well, she does in her own way. <laughs> Oh my goodness me. Hi my people! Happy Valentine's! It's the 14th of February! Got my Valentine's card right here! I can actually see I've got Valentine's card. I've got my red lippy on for Valentine's. I've got my red nails on for Valentine's. Oh my goodness me. So I spoke to you. Now we don't know that this is all going to be on the same vlog. But the last time I vlogged was yesterday to me. <laughs> the 13th people so I came in from the gym and um, I, I broke my fast I had a chat with my friend Lux and Rosie's I had the sniffles you probably noticed on the walk like I said we don't know until it comes to editing if all the vlogs are gonna be one <laughs> But um, I had the sniffles and I literally got like a cold, like a common cold. I had the sniffles, I was sneezing, I was, oh, it was just, just you know, the usual common cold then. I thought, do you know what, I better take my vitamins because I've been forgetting these couple of nights. I've just broken my fast and I took my magnesium. Don't know if it was my magnesium, don't know if I was just exhausted. I haven't been sleeping well. I did sleep well last night, really well last night. But Monday... Like Sunday night, I didn't really sleep, sleep well and I put it down to overindulgence of the weekend. No exercise on the Sunday. So on the Monday, I kind of got tired again and I had a wee nap during the day. And you know I don't like to nap during the day because to me that's a symptom of something's not right with me. Anyway, I had a wee nap on Monday. 
and then yesterday I had the sniffles blah 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 I did my chat da, 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 and I thought right let me go upstairs and start cleaning I was kind of late on in starting yesterday went upstairs the sun's beaming through the bedroom and I went and I kind of just went let me just have a look at my phone picked up my phone I went do you know what I'm tired and I slept and I had a right good sleep in the afternoon then woke up and I thought oh my goodness still had all the sniffles and all that I thought that's me that is me definitely coming down with something and anyway, I managed to finish my housework finished really late because I started really late because I had the nap blah 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 and um I finished just in time to watch Love Island and it had a right good night's sleep last night did not feel like a nap today woke up I was a bit groggy in the morning but people nothing now absolutely nothing <laughs> right I need to go and cook I want to upload I've been trying to edit this video on the never full since the weekend and I just people I haven't been bothered but I also need to go and cook oh I don't know if there's an appointment going to cook now because Rico's going to be home soon and he can cook <laughs> I think I'll just start editing just got we've got chicken in and bought some chicken thighs which don't take long I was thinking of putting them all in a pot like chicken thighs the green beans and the cauliflower do you know what I think I might just do that in a tomato sauce just throw in some herbs I'm gonna do that just all kind of a, a one pot thing before he comes home shall I can I be bothered <laughs> I don't know I don't know we'll see hello and welcome to the 15th of February we have just arrived at Ikea I am looking at getting a new desk because the one I've got is a bit bulky and a bit squeaky so we're gonna go and have a look at maybe getting a new desk and a new chair so are you ready for this Rico? Not really, no. <laughs> we had a lovely wee scenario before we left as well. Didn't we Rico? No. Yeah we did. About the scenario. About Rico's just been getting annoyed with somebody. Um, well, with, with the that's phone. That's do. So I don't know if I was holding the phone at this point or whatever. I said Rico, oh I've left my phone upstairs. So he went upstairs to get my phone. Uh -huh. Didn't you? That's right. And I started dialing Ikea to see if they would allow Lily and I'm talking away to Ikea and he's going press the button on your Apple watch so I can find you your phone neither of us at this point had clocked that I was actually on the phone talking and we <laughs> and then you blamed me. Of course I did. <laughs> yeah, but you knew I was on the phone and you were still looking for it. I didn't know you were on that phone. It could have been on that phone. Well, oh, that excuses were both. It was really quite pathetic. We were both quite pathetic. <laughs> oh, and he's, I'd, I'd hang up. I, f I finished on my phone call. And I said, to him, Rick, I've got the phone. <laughs> so he, he had a few chosen words, didn't you? Not at all. <laughs> I laughed it off. Ha ha ha. Right, let's go find this desk. Right, let's go. Okay, we think we have decided on a desk, but we are now looking at chairs. I like. Well, Rico likes this one. Thinks this will be a nice one. Um, for the room. And it's white. I like the comfort of this one. But it's cream. Doesn't really match the room. Is that is that one mu 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 much more wider than that one? Rico, see this? Yeah, and it's just a big little, isn't it? I know, but it's, you've got the option of both.
This is nice. I like this. I like this. I just like everything the size of it. It's got the big, what do you call it, and the island in the middle. Then you've got your dining table there because there's a stupid sink. It's not the only thing, it's a separate sink. It's like we've got for your, see, perfect. We one there, the other one there. Ah, this is my kitchen, people. Oh, look, look at, oh. Look at this for your larder, look. Look at that, Rico. Except we don't eat pasta. He's, see, we talk to ourselves. I'm this, he's that. They don't like pasta. <laughs> it's not that oh, put your actually. wine up there. It's big enough for us. Oh, it's too double, is it? Oh, what's that? Your rubbish? Okay, now I was brought up with a wee bin in the bloody side of the kitchen. And then you've got your wee sitting area there. Rico. So that'd be the, the the kitchen area, our kitchen area that we've got. Yeah. The extension and the playroom becomes one room. Yeah, okay. okay. Gin. The man that always says to me, let's just go and get what we want and not waste time. Look at him. <laughs> We are done. Okay, just before I start stripping, I thought I'd do a, an outfit of the day. <laughs> Very casual today. So baggy jeans, which is something I don't normally wear, but I've had these for years. These are from next because bringing in all the shopping while I do an outfit of the day. This is why I'm such an annoying wife. <laughs> and, and I have my Palm Springs Mini. So another bag I've been asked to review, there we go. Jumper from, where was this from people? I can't remember. Was this the Rita Ora one from last year, Primark Rita Ora? Anyway, that's our outfit. And the boots are from, old from Zara, which I love. That's my outfit. Oh, is she baby, 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 baby? <laughs> yes, baby. Would you like a wee treat? Where are they? Let's go. Come on then. Come on then. Come on. Got candles. I showed you all this in IKEA, didn't I? I'm sure it. But anyway, come on then. Let's get one. Come on then. Okay, so this is like one of these clipboard things I got for the wall. And these are just little accessories. I only picked up two accessories for it just until we see what I actually need. Tea lights. Got scented and unscented and another wee accessory for that thing whatever it's called and this these i think that's the arms for the chair and then this candle which is the same one i bought the last time i was there i absolutely love it's 15 pounds for that there we go i think that's all we got oh no this is what i wanted to show you <laughs> So people, when I used to eat sugary stuff, I always used to pick one of these up from Ikea. I haven't picked one up for ages, but do you know what? I picked two up. To make up for lost time. <laughs> don't know if you heard Rico's what you said there, but anyway, for the freezer. Rico says, we having dime bar tonight? I says, no, we are not having dime bar. We're going to keep it in the freezer as a special occasion. There is my desk. There is my Lily who's very excited because she's just had a little treat and she's excited because mummy and daddy are home. Is that right, Lily? <laughs> Rico's very excited about building all of this. I need to go and get the room ready. Rico's always checking everything when he comes home receipts. And I have my, well, no, that's, it's not my first birthday gift, but one of my birthday gifts <laughs> has arrived. So we have to keep this until next. Sunday. Woohoo! 
we are going to start cleaning out the room. Well, I'm going to start cleaning out the room because I want to see what I'm going to do here. If I'm going to move these down, put the desk coming from in there and out. I don't know. <clears throat> At the moment, I have no idea what we are going to do. Hello and welcome to February the 16th and my new setup. But still set up the same, but I did change it around and then changed it all back again. So welcome to the 16th of February, Friday. We will do a little tour of the room. It just looks pretty much the same, just different furnishings. And I'm going to be that annoying person that's going to be swinging around on this chair. The room's a lot more comfortable for me as it is now. And it's given me the space that I need. But we'll get into that. I'll turn the camera around and show you what the changes are. So it's Friday, I started off my day with Metafit. I then came back and then started tidying up the house because with Rico building and this and that, it just got in the way that I don't like it to be. <laughs> you know, somebody else might walk in and think, there's nothing wrong, but for me, it just, the house was not sitting right. So I came back after Metafit, I started tidying up and then I went back and I did circuits, came back and my house is sitting like just now. So I decided it was time to pamper. So you know how I always have one week of the month where everything needs doing? It's the week coming. And coincidentally, it's worked out really well because it's my birthday next weekend. So this, I would, I like to get things done for my birthday anyway so this week i'll be getting my eyebrows threaded i'll be getting my color done a full color done i'll be getting my nails back to my french with the chrome and all of that but i started off today i dyed my eyebrows because oh, i can't keep up with the grease in my my eyebrows people anyway i dyed my eyebrows today because they just would desperately i've been using castor oil all week which i am loving even using it in my belly button so google it people google castor oil so i have been using it on my eyelashes i've been using it as a moisturizer actually last thing at night so basically i've been pampering myself i've even got like um moisturizing so i can't show you i can't i can't even lift my leg up people this can I lift my leg up? I've actually put uh, socks over the actual, my feet are roasting, over these Hello Kitty moisturising and refreshing foot mask. So I've got them on under my socks so, so I can walk about. Moisturising my feet, I've taken the nail varnish off my toenails, I'm going to repaint them. I'm, I'm going to repaint my nails as well actually because they're looking a bit... Ugh. got my engagement ring back about two hours ago it's looking can you see it it's looking so they've put a bigger diamond in which is what it was needed it was obvious the diamond that they had put in was not big enough i can still tell which one has been changed still not 100 percent but I can't people can I don't know what Rico's making downstairs. We're having stir fry for dinner. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to stop this swinging. I'm gonna have to lock the chair so I don't swing a bit. Right, so that's what I've been up to today. So my house is sitting perfectly. I've still got to iron. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna edit. Why does that door keep opening? Oh, uh, Lily's teddy bear's blocking it. I was wondering if it was keep opening. Right, should we do a little tour of the room and show you what's new? Last night was late. It was a late one last night. But, um, yes, we got everything in and Rico built it all. I moved all the shelves down. Let's talk about it with the camera. Okay. This is how the room is looking. So, what I did yesterday... Right, Mr. Teddy Bear, move out the way so we can close the door. So what I did was I moved all the shelving all to one side of the room and it actually made it look bigger and put the desk in here. So it was just, it basically looked the way it looks now as it is, but under the window 
So basically when you're filming, you need to be facing a window. You can't really have the window behind you because you, you, you need the light in front of you. And if I can use natural light, I like to use natural light. So anyway, I moved this down, rearranged all the bags last night and I didn't like it. I felt everything looked squashed. The light looked squashed up against the window there and blah, blah, blah. So we then moved everything back again, rearranged the bags. Anyway, this is the new desk and this actually gives me more room because it's not as wide as the other one and it's given me extra space because it's longer because when I'm filming and I need to place things down here I can now move my laptop over so I had like one of these um what they called like a bedside table you know the ones you have at your bed that slide under the bed and you can work at your bed I had one sitting there it was different levels things kept falling off it because it wasn't sitting right so honestly I love it I've also now got drawers here as well which is ideal thought this one wasn't going to open but I can actually get in and out of it that's that's all my like my wee stands and things um for the cameras and the phone down there are my empties and I picked this up from Ikea as well and you can add lots of different pots and things onto it and trays so I just bought this tray here and you can sit things on it and I've got the hooks because I used to have like hooks on my table before which you couldn't see but it's kind of sitting here I had hooks where I would hook all these wires because I need to hook my camera onto my laptop and blah 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 I need all those wires and I need them at my reach I've got my battery charger in there my extra battery there I'm thinking of Kind of moving this off the desk and getting a pot to clip onto there to put them. Anyway, the new chair which goes up and down and swings which is going to annoy you all. And that's basically my room and I absolutely love it. It looks like when I pass by the room from outside it just makes me smile. And that just sits it all off people. It just sits it all off so this all looks the same birthday presents are starting together and yeah I'll keep my keep all there and then all the and that's not all of it people in there so everything else just is the same as it was before so got my scarf drawer in here was kind of all the stuff so I'm still trying to rearrange this drawer here because it was, I kept all my stuff that I've now got in those two drawers. So I'm going to actually get all of that moved out of there. And kind of use it for maybe hats and things like that. We'll see. But I'm very, very chuffed. It is the perfect, perfect table. I'll put it down in my description box. I'll put all of this in my description box. Um, these, these are great by the way just hook on you and they come in different sizes but I didn't want anything too big so I'm uh, very chuffed so that's it so all I've got to do now is iron edit do my mask and I've not done my skincare or anything because I want to do my mask I've just let my hair air dry that's what it looks like when I just leave it air dry I actually did a hair mask as well on my hair do I have that here Yes, I do. And my empties. I did, this is the hair mask that I did. So this is from Lush. I did that. I tell you, I did the lot, people. I did the lot. Hair mask. Foot mask. I'm going to put castor oil on my hands tonight when I go to bed. Some in my belly button. Castor oil on my face after I do my serums. Do my eye serum. My night repair eye serums from Estee Lauder and then I cover myself in castor oil on my lashes and all of that and <laughs> I'm not going to say I think it's made a difference because I think it has but nobody's going to believe that I think it's just because they're moisturised I think what's happening the castor oil is moisturising the eyelashes so it's making them look much better if the truth be said 
right that's my little update and that's how my room is looking and i'm swinging again <laughs> feels so good <laughs> dear to me so face mask creams and that's me all getting ready for the camp a week oh i can't wait nails on thursday we're gonna do french with chrome full color saturday with my highlights which i'm desperately needing and threading i'm gonna go at one point this week don't know when and get my eyebrows threaded and that will be me <laughs>